The latest method of passing safety net without magis guide and by using Zygisk. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you the latest method of bypassing safety net on your Android device without using magis guide and by using Zygisk. Now, those of you who do not know, Pretty soon in the future, a new build of Magisk is going to be released wherein you will not have the option of Magisk hide and you will also not have the option of checking for safety net from within the Magisk application. Now here it is. This is a canary build of Magisk right now and we do not have the option of Magisk hide if you go into the settings. Similarly, you also do not have the option of checking for safety net. So first of all let us go ahead and use a safety net checker application so here it is we do have some advertisements but you can see it has failed there is another application which is yet another safety net checker so this one also says that it is hardware attestation and basic and cts profile both have failed then the next check we can do is we can go ahead and open the google play store and once we are in the play store we can go into settings and about here it is play protect certification device is not certified so we are going to fix all of this in this video first of all open the magisk application and then you need to tap on the gear icon on the top right which is your settings here in first of all enable zygisk now once you have enabled zygisk you do need to reboot your device back into android we can unlock our device and then we are going to open the magisk app one more time tap on the settings icon on the top right make sure that zygisk is enabled then enable the option of enforce denial list tap on configure denial list this is going to open a list of applications tap on the three dot menu on the top right and select show system applications once this is done tap on search icon and here and we need to search for play once you search for play you should get something called google play services tap on google play services it is going to give you a bunch of other toggles so the toggles which you need to enable are the first one which is your com.google.android.gms and then the second one is gms unstable these are the two toggles which you need to enable and then we can tap on google play services one more time to unexpand this now after this we are going to reboot our device one more time back into android we can unlock our device and then we can go ahead and go into matches and confirm that our settings are still there so zygisk is enabled denial list is enabled going to configure it should be enabled for the google play services tap on this double checking everything the two toggles are enabled then let us try to run another safety net check so you will notice that basic has passed however cts is still failing which means we need a magisk module now what if both of them are passing for you at this stage then all you need to do is you would go into settings apps go into your manage applications here and search for the google play services if they do not show up three dot menu on the top right and say show all apps search for google play services here it is go into clear data manage space clear all the data for google play services similarly do this for the google play store as well and reboot your device and you should be good to go for those of you who are like me and you do not have your cts passing cts is failing we need to download this magisk by k dragon now do note the link is in the description of the video he has released a new build super important thing to note over here it says zygisk in the bracket which means this module is for those of you who are running magisk with zygisk which means that you are running magisk wherein the option of magisk hide has been removed so all you need to do is scroll down 
tap on assets download this module which is a zip file tap on it the file was downloaded successfully next up open your magisk app one more time and then we can go to the home page of magisk fourth option bottom right is modules install from storage and then we are going to tap on the three bar menu on the top left select your devices name this will take you to your internal storage if you downloaded the module on your phone directly it will be in the download folder select this we can change the view here it is safety net fix version 2.2.0 zero which is the latest at the time of recording this video select it reboot your device once the installation has finished successfully now do note in case you run into a boot loop because of this magisk module we do have videos showing you how to fix a boot loop caused by a magisk module that is linked in the description of the video another important thing to note over here is that make sure you download the Zygisk version and the latest one which is available on the releases page anyways we are back into android and now we can go into magisk one more time again double checking everything so here it is module installed it is active now we can run our safety net attestation check one more time here it is basic is passing cts is passing we can try the other application as well here it is you can see everything is passing everything is green now we will go into the settings application go into apps manage apps again three dot menu on the top right show all apps is already selected and we are going to search for play one more time google play services clear data manage space clear all the data select okay once this is done we are going to go back and we have to repeat the same process for the google play store as well so we are again going to search for play google play store clear data clear all data okay and then one last reboot of our device back into android we can run another test and make sure everything is working absolutely fine here it is everything is passing and then the next thing we are going to do is we will go to the google play store and here and we can again go into the play store settings about here it is play protect certification device is certified now super important thing to note over here device is now certified and if your banking apps do not work what do you do open magisk go into settings herein configure your deny list and add any app for which you want to hide your root or magisk tap on it check mark it reboot your device and you should be good to go another option you have is to hide your magisk application again this is hiding the magisk app not magisk hide which is hiding your root access this is hiding the magisk app tap on it give it any name your magisk app will disappear and get another name now another important thing if none of this is working for you then you either need to have the props from your pixel devices or you need to use magisk hide props application and there it is peeps that is how you bypass safety net with the latest magisk version without magisk hide and by using zygisk and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.